All right, what's going on, everyone? Today is April 29, 2020. We are HFN, also known as UFN News. This is the location to where we're here to take some of this money out the market trapper's bag. You guys can see him right there at the bottom left side of my screen. He's the one that is trying to take our money from us. We need to try to take the money from him and put it into our pocket. So if you're interested in that, this is your first time watching our video. Go ahead, hit that like button, share the video, subscribe to this channel. If you want more of opportunity to try to take the bag from the market trapper, join us on our own website at hughfinancial.com because this is what we do. We're here to give you all price predictions and forecast the easy way to understand precisely what this trap is trying to do to us and today's video is going to be about cardano and from our last video that we did for this cryptocurrency was on april 26 2020 you guys can clearly see already of our expectations in cardano let me go ahead and zoom in so you all can see a little bit better the market we have been tracking ever since it's been falling that ascending line that's not difficult to understand it's not even difficult to see is that seemingly every day you know cardano has been trading the market has been falling that line and it is definitely still doing that to this day now we are trading away from it so that is what i call being overextended the market is trading so far away from that trend that has been following that we broke off from it and you might need to be a little bit cautious for another movement to the downside and it's going to be one of swiftness it's going to be real quick when it occurs All right, so currently, when we did our video in Cardano on the 26th, we told you that we was looking for the market to move higher and come up there towards that five cents level. And guess what? It did it today. So 10.44% uh, profitability bagged. We took it from the market trap and we put it back in our own pockets. All right, right there. So let's get rid of it. And the reason why we had five cents for restriction on our last video was because literally that's where Cardano found some support and prior restriction back in 2019 of last year. OK, so we're there now. Taking a look at Cardano on the weekly time frame, you all can still see here that the market generally is still showing us a lot of strength. We got a couple more days left. I mean, we got four days and 13 hours before this current price bar ends but going forward this area four and a half cents is a very good area of support so cardano cannot break below that going forward you understand that right it cannot break below four and a half cents in order to maintain the momentum that was built up all the way back here the last couple of weeks it can do it because if it breaks back down below four and a half cents it's going to test four cents and even this ascending line that we got drawn in our chart so yeah everything in the market so far in cardano still looks on course to continue to see the move higher but caution definitely is warranted right now for the cryptocurrency for the two reasons first one five cents is restriction second one we are overextended from the overall trend in the market for cardano so i'm just giving you all that heads up right now and cardano to have a plan as to what you'll do in terms of the reasoning as to why we may need to be pumping the brakes okay now currently like i said the market is still giving us a lot of viability and momentum and, and movement higher but one of the concerns I have is that once I complete this video, the market in Cardano will switch and turn back down to the downside. So I'm looking to hold out into the market in Cardano, maybe give it like a couple more days or so, but just give you some pins to place into your mental is that four and a half cents going forward has to be support. And just to be cautious because we are trading so far away from the overall trend in this market in Cardano. Okay, so I'm not going to put in the forecast. The strength definitely is still there, but how long would that last? And unknowingly, I'm not suspecting that it's going to last until I come back and do another update for Cardano. So I'm just going to sideline the market in our forecast in Cardano. As of this particular recording, the market still looks great. I mean, the strength is still appearing 
and Cardano. But once I get off this recording, it may even change. So just wanted to talk to you all about what we're getting, how the market is likely to play out, what to be on guard for from the trap. And that's all you need to do in order to make your own decisions. So I'm not going to put a forecast in. I'm just going to sit the sideline on this one. We took something to bag from the trapper already. And I just want to sit the sideline and give him a better depiction on what he's going to do around this restriction level of five cents. All right. Now you let me know what you think. Leave me a comment. All right, I'm out.